Hey there, coin collectors and history buffs. Welcome back to our channel where we explore all things numismatic. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of the 1940 Lincoln penny with the elusive D mint mark. Could this coin be worth a small fortune? Let's find out together. First off, let's talk a bit about the 1940 Lincoln penny. This coin was minted during a pivotal time in American history, just before the United States entered World War II. The design features Abraham Lincoln on the obverse and the iconic wheat ears on the reverse. But what sets this particular penny apart is the D mint mark, indicating it was minted in Denver, Colorado. And now, you might be wondering, what's the big deal about mint marks? Well, mint marks play a crucial role in determining the rarity and value of a coin. Coins minted at different locations can have varying mintages, making certain coins more scarce and valuable to collectors. In the case of the 1940 Lincoln penny with the D mint mark, its limited mintage adds to its allure for numismatists.so. Here's the million dollar question Is the 1940 D Lincoln penny worth a lot of big money? The short answer is it depends. While most 1940 Lincoln pennies are relatively common and don't command high prices, those with the D mint mark are a different story. Due to their lower mintage numbers, these coins can fetch a premium in the numismatic market, especially if they are in pristine condition. When determining the value of a 1940 D Lincoln penny, there are several factors to consider. The coin's condition, or grade, plays a major role in its worth. A coin that is well-preserved with minimal wear and crisp details will be more valuable than one that is heavily circulated. Additionally, the presence of any mint errors or varieties can further increase the coin's value to collectors. As of the time of filming this video, the current market value of a 1940D Lincoln penny in average circulated condition ranges from a few dollars to around $20. However, for coins in higher grades such as extremely fine or mint state, the value can soar into the hundreds or even thousands of dollars. It's always a good idea to consult with a professional coin appraiser or dealer to get an accurate valuation of your coin out if you're on the hunt for a 1940D Lincoln penny to add to your collection, there are a few places you can look. Local coin shops, coin shows, and online auction sites like eBay are great sources for finding rare coins. Just remember to do your due diligence and verify the authenticity of the coin before making a purchase. In conclusion, the 1940D Lincoln penny with the coveted mint mark is a fascinating piece of numismatic history that can potentially be worth a lot of big money. Its combination of historical significance, mint mark rarity, and condition all contribute to its value in the eyes of collectors. So, keep your eyes peeled for this elusive coin in your coin searches, you never know when you might stumble upon a hidden gem. 1960 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark worth a lot of big money? So grab your magnifying glass and let's take a closer look at this shiny, little piece of history. First off, let's talk a little bit about the 1960 Lincoln penny itself. This particular coin is made of 95% copper and 5% zinc, giving it that distinctive reddish hue that we all know and love. The front of the coin features a profile of President Abraham Lincoln, while the back showcases the Lincoln Memorial. It's a classic design that has stood the test of time and now, you may be wondering what the D mint mark signifies on this coin. Well, the D actually stands for the Denver Mint, one of the United States mint facilities responsible for producing circulating coinage. The presence of this mint mark indicates that the coin was minted in Denver, Colorado, adding a touch of history and rarity to the piece.so. Back to the million dollar question, is the 1960 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark worth a lot of big money? The short answer is, maybe. You see, the value of a coin is determined by a variety of factors, including its rarity, condition, and demand among collectors. In the case of the 1960 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark, there are a few key things to consider. Point one important factor to keep in mind is the mintage of the coin. In 1960, the Denver Mint produced a total of 586,405,000 Lincoln pennies, which may seem like a large number at first glance. However, compared to other years, this mintage is actually relatively low, making the 1960D penny somewhat scarce compared to its counterparts. In addition to mintage numbers, the condition of the coin can also play a significant role in determining its value. A well preserved 1960 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark in mint condition may command a higher price among collectors, especially if it exhibits strong luster and minimal wear. On the other hand, a heavily circulated or damaged coin may not hold as much value in the eyes of collectors. Another important factor to consider is the demand for the coin among collectors. 
Some numismatists are particularly drawn to coins with mint marks, such as the 1960D penny, as they are seen as a unique piece of history that adds a special touch to a collection. This higher demand can drive up the value of the coin, especially if it is in high demand among collectors. So, how much could a 1960 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark potentially be worth? Well, it's hard to say for sure without actually seeing the coin in question. However, in general, a well preserved 1960D penny in mint condition could fetch anywhere from a few dollars to potentially hundreds of dollars, depending on the specific characteristics of the coin and the current market demand. If you happen to have a 1960 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark in your possession, it may be worth taking a closer look at it to assess its condition and potential value. You never know, you could be holding onto a hidden gem that could fetch you a pretty penny, and there you have it, folks. The 1960 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark may not be the holy grail of coin collecting, but it certainly holds its own in terms of value and historical significance. So next time you come across one of these shiny treasures, remember to give it a second glance, you never know what hidden treasures may be waiting to be discovered. 1961 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark, could this seemingly ordinary coin actually be worth a lot of big money? Let's find out, first things first. Let's talk about the significance of the D mint mark. In the world of coin collecting, mint marks play a crucial role in determining the rarity and value of a coin. The D mint mark indicates that the coin was struck at the Denver Mint, one of the oldest operating mints in the United States. Coins with a D mint mark are generally considered to be more valuable than those without, as they are typically produced in smaller quantities. Now, let's take a closer look at the 1961 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark. On the surface, this coin may not seem like anything special, after all, it's just a penny, right? Wrong. As it turns out, the 1961 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark is actually quite rare and sought after by collectors. This particular coin was produced during a time when the United States Mint was transitioning from using solid bronze composition to a copper-plated zinc composition, making it a unique and valuable piece of American history. So, how can you tell if you have a 1961 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark in your collection? Well, the first thing you'll want to do is carefully examine the coin for any identifying marks. The mint mark can typically be found on the reverse side of the coin, below the weed years and above the letters 1 cent. If you see a small D stamped on the coin, congratulations, you may have just hit the jackpot. Now, let's talk numbers. How much could a 1961 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark actually be worth? Well, that all depends on the condition of the coin and the current market demand. In general, a 1961 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark in decent condition could be worth anywhere from a few dollars to a few hundred dollars. However, if you happen to stumble upon a coin in pristine condition, you could be looking at a payday of several thousand dollars, now that's some serious cash, but wait, there's more. In rare cases, a 1961 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark could be worth even more than you could ever imagine. Some collectors have reported finding coins with minting errors or unique characteristics that have fetched prices in the tens of thousands of dollars. One such example is the 1961 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark that was accidentally struck on a silver planchet, making it an incredibly rare and valuable find. So, what should you do if you believe you have a 1961 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark that could be worth a lot of big money? Well, the first step is to have the coin authenticated and graded by a reputable coin grading service. This will help to establish the coin's authenticity and condition, which are crucial factors in determining its value. Once you have the coin graded, you can then decide whether you want to hold on to it as a valuable piece of your collection or sell it to a collector or dealer for a handsome profit. In conclusion, the 1961 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark is a true hidden gem in the world of coin collecting. While it may seem like just a humble penny, this coin has the potential to be worth a lot of big money if you happen to have one in your possession. So, keep your eyes peeled and your coin collection organized, you never know when you might stumble upon a rare and valuable treasure like the 1961 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark. 1964 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark. Have you ever wondered if this little copper coin could be worth a lot of big money? Well, you're in luck because that's exactly what we're going to explore in this video. Let's start by taking a closer look at the 1964 Lincoln penny itself. This coin is part of the famous Lincoln Penny series that has been minted by the United States Mint since 1909. The 1964 edition is particularly interesting because it marks the end of the wheat penny design that had been in circulation for over 50 years. 
Instead of the wheat ears on the reverse, the 1964 penny features the Lincoln Memorial, making it a unique and sought-after piece for collectors. Now, let's talk about that elusive D-mint mark. In numismatics, mint marks indicate where a coin was minted. In the case of the 1964 Lincoln penny, the D-mint mark signifies that the coin was struck at the Denver Mint in Colorado. Mint marks can greatly affect the value of a coin, as some mint locations produce fewer coins than others, making them rarer and more desirable to collectors. So, the big question remains, is a 1964 Lincoln penny with a D-mint mark worth a lot of big money? The short answer is, it depends. Like with any rare coin, there are several factors that determine its value. One of the most important factors is the coin's condition. A well-preserved, uncirculated 1964 Lincoln penny with a D-mint mark could fetch a pretty penny at auction, while a heavily worn or damaged coin may not be worth much more than its face value. Another key factor to consider is the rarity of the coin. While the 1964 Lincoln penny with a D-mint mark is not considered extremely rare, it is still a valuable and collectible piece for those interested in the Lincoln Penny series. Some collectors are willing to pay top dollar for coins in exceptional condition or with unique characteristics, such as errors or varieties. Speaking of errors and varieties, it's worth mentioning that not all 1964 Lincoln pennies with a D-mint mark are created equal. Some coins may have double dies, repunched mint marks, or other anomalies that make them even more valuable to collectors. If you're lucky enough to stumble upon one of these rare varieties, you could be looking at a substantial payday. Of course, the best way to determine the value of your 1964 Lincoln penny with a D-mint mark is to have it professionally appraised. A coin dealer or numismatic expert can assess the condition, rarity, and market demand for your coin, giving you a better idea of its worth. You can also check online resources, coin pricing guides, and auction results to get an estimate of what similar coins have sold for in the past. In conclusion, while a 1964 Lincoln penny with a D-mint mark may not make you an instant millionaire, it is still a fascinating and potentially valuable piece of American numismatic history. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting out, adding this coin to your collection could be a smart investment and an exciting treasure hunt. 1967 Lincoln Penny Without a Mint Mark You may be wondering, is this little copper coin worth a lot of big money? Well, stick around because we're about to uncover the mysteries behind this potentially valuable piece of history. First things first, let's address the most important question, why is the 1967 Lincoln penny without a mint mark so sought after by collectors? Well, the absence of a mint mark indicates that this particular coin was struck at the Philadelphia Mint, which was known for producing less coins compared to other mints. This lower mintage makes the 1967 Lincoln penny without a mint mark a rare find, driving up its value significantly and now, you may be wondering just how much this rare coin is worth. Well, the value of the 1967 Lincoln penny without a mint mark can vary greatly depending on its condition and overall rarity. In average circulated condition, this coin can be worth anywhere from a few dollars to upwards of $50. However, if you happen to come across one in pristine, uncirculated condition, you could be looking at a value of several hundred dollars or even more. If you're lucky enough to stumble upon a 1967 Lincoln penny without a mint mark, there are a few things you should do to ensure you get the most value out of it. First and foremost, get it authenticated by a reputable coin grading service. This will help establish the coin's authenticity and grade, which are crucial factors in determining its value. Once you have the coin authenticated, you can consider selling it at a coin auction or through a reputable coin dealer to maximize your profit potential. Collecting rare coins like the 1967 Lincoln penny without a mint mark can be a rewarding and exciting hobby. Not only do you have the opportunity to potentially uncover valuable treasures, but you also get to learn about the rich history behind each coin. So, whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting out, keep an eye out for those elusive coins that could be hiding in your pocket change. In conclusion, the 1967 Lincoln penny without a mint mark is definitely a coin worth keeping an eye out for. Its rarity and potential value make it a prized addition to any coin collection. So, next time you come across a shiny copper penny from 1967, be sure to check for that elusive mint mark, you never know, it could be your ticket to a big payday. 1968 Lincoln penny with an S mint mark If you're new to the game, mint marks are small letters that represent where a coin was produced. And in the case of the 1968 Lincoln penny, the S indicates that it was minted at the San Francisco Mint. Now, you might be wondering if this little penny is worth more than just one cent. 
Well, the short answer is yes, it could be worth a pretty penny, pun intended. The 1968 Lincoln penny with an S mint mark is considered a key date coin, which means it's relatively rare compared to other pennies from that year. With a mintage of only 258,270,000, finding one in your pocket change is like striking gold, but here's where things get really interesting. While most 1968 Lincoln pennies with an S mint mark are worth around 10 to 25 cents in circulated condition, there are a few rare varieties that can fetch a much higher price. One of the most sought after varieties is the 1968S double die obverse, which features doubling on the front of the coin. These coins can sell for hundreds, if not thousands, of dollars to the right collector. Another valuable variety to look out for is the 1968S proof penny. Proof coins are meticulously struck multiple times with specially polished dies, resulting in a mirror-like finish. These coins are often sold in sets by the U.S. Mint to collectors, making them highly sought after. A 1968S proof penny in pristine condition can command a premium price at auction.so. How can you tell if your 1968 Lincoln penny is one of these rare varieties? Well, the first step is to carefully examine the coin under a magnifying glass. Look for any signs of doubling on the front of the coin, especially on the date and lettering. If you see distinct doubling, congratulations, you may have hit the jackpot. Next, check the overall condition of the coin. Is it shiny and free of scratches and blemishes? If so, you may have a proof penny on your hands. Proof coins are known for their pristine appearance, so any signs of wear or damage could indicate that your coin is not a proof. If you're still unsure about the value of your 1968 Lincoln penny with an S mint mark, consider taking it to a reputable coin dealer or getting it professionally graded by a third party grading service. These experts can provide you with an accurate assessment of your coin's value and help you determine the best course of action to maximize its potential worth. In conclusion, the 1968 Lincoln penny with an S mint mark is definitely worth taking a closer look at. While most are only worth a few cents, there are rare varieties out there that can fetch a pretty penny, no pun intended this time. So, dig through your coin collection, check your piggy bank, and keep an eye out for that elusive 1968S double die obverse or proof penny. Who knows, you could be holding onto a fortune without even realizing it. 1978 Lincoln penny without a mint mark. You may be wondering why a seemingly ordinary penny could be worth a lot of big money, but trust me, there's more to this coin than meets the eye. First things first, let's start by exploring the history behind the 1978 Lincoln penny. This coin was minted during a time when the United States mint was going through some major changes. In 1978, the mint was in the process of transitioning from minting coins with mint marks to coins without mint marks. This transition led to a limited number of 1978 Lincoln pennies being struck without a mint mark, making them quite rare and highly sought after by collectors at now. You may be wondering how to identify a 1978 Lincoln penny without a mint mark. Well, it's quite simple, just take a close look at the bottom of the coin, right underneath the date. If you don't see a letter indicating the mint where the coin was struck, then you've got yourself a rare gem in your hands. Keep in mind that the absence of a mint mark doesn't necessarily mean that the coin is valuable, but in the case of the 1978 Lincoln penny, it definitely adds to its appeal. So, how much is a 1978 Lincoln penny without a mint mark worth? The value of this coin can vary greatly depending on its condition and scarcity. In general, a circulated 1978 Lincoln penny without a mint mark can fetch around $300 to $500 while an uncirculated coin in pristine condition can be worth upwards of $1,000 or more. Keep in mind that these are just rough estimates and the actual value of the coin can fluctuate based on market demand and other factors. Point one of the reasons why the 1978 Lincoln penny without a mint mark is so valuable is its scarcity. As I mentioned earlier, only a limited number of these coins were minted, making them quite rare and hard to come by. This rarity factor is a major driver of the coin's value, as collectors are willing to pay top dollar to add this elusive coin to their collection. Another reason why the 1978 Lincoln penny without a mint mark is worth a lot of big money is its unique historical significance. This coin represents a pivotal moment in the history of the United States mint, marking the transition from mint marks to no mint marks. For many collectors, owning a piece of history like this is priceless, which is why they're willing to pay a premium for the coin. Not if you're lucky enough to have a 1978 Lincoln penny without a mint mark in your possession, there are a few things you can do to maximize its value. First and foremost, make sure to keep the coin in a protective holder or case to prevent any damage or wear. 
The better the condition of the coin, the higher its value will be. Additionally, consider getting the coin professionally graded by a reputable coin grading service to authenticate its rarity and condition. This can add credibility to the coin and potentially increase its value even further. I in conclusion, the 1978 Lincoln penny without a mint mark is a fascinating coin with a lot of big money potential. Its rarity, historical significance, and unique appeal make it a highly sought after piece among collectors. If you happen to come across one of these rare gems, consider yourself lucky and take good care of it. Who knows, you might just have a small fortune sitting in your pocket. 1979 Lincoln Penny with a D-Mint Mark You may be wondering if this humble penny is worth a lot of big money. Well, stick around as we uncover the secrets behind this little treasure. First things first, let's talk about the importance of mint marks on coins. Mint marks indicate where a coin was minted, and they can drastically affect its value. The D-Mint Mark on a 1979 Lincoln Penny signifies that it was minted in Denver, Colorado. Coins minted in Denver tend to be scarcer than those minted in Philadelphia, so that already adds some value to our penny. Next, let's discuss the condition of the coin. The value of any coin is heavily influenced by its grade, which is determined by factors such as wear, luster, and any imperfections. A 1979 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark in uncirculated condition can fetch a pretty penny compared to one that has seen a lot of circulation. That if you happen to stumble upon a 1979 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark that looks like it just rolled off the minting press, you could be looking at a coin worth anywhere from $5 to $10 or even more, depending on the market demand. Remember, the key is to preserve the coin's condition as much as possible to retain its value, but what if your 1979 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark is not in uncirculated condition? Fear not, as there are still opportunities for profit. In the world of coin collecting, even coins with slight wear can hold value, especially if they are rare or have unique characteristics, for example, if your 1979 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark is a key date or has an error such as a double die or off-center strike, its value could skyrocket. These types of coins are highly sought after by collectors and can sell for hundreds or even thousands of dollars. It's always a good idea to inspect your coins closely for any abnormalities or unique features that could potentially increase their value. Pay attention to small details such as doubling on the date or mint mark, as these can be indicators of a valuable error coin. I in the world of coin collecting, you never know what treasures you may come across. That's what makes it so exciting. So, the next time you're sorting through your loose change, Keep an eye out for that 1979 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark. It could be your ticket to some big money. As we wrap up today's episode, we hope you've enjoyed learning about the potential value of the 1979 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark. Remember, even the smallest coins can hold significant value in the world of numismatics. Stay curious, keep exploring, and happy collecting. 1981 Lincoln penny without a mint mark. Could this seemingly ordinary coin actually be worth a fortune? Let's find out. First, let's talk a bit about the 1981 Lincoln Penny. This copper-plated coin was produced by the United States Mint in Denver and Philadelphia, as well as San Francisco for proof sets. But here's the catch, the regular circulating coin should have a D or P mint mark under the year, indicating where they were minted. However, in some rare cases, a small number of 1981 pennies were mistakenly minted without a mint mark, the absence of a mint mark on the 1981 Lincoln penny has puzzled collectors for decades. Some speculate that it was an error caused by a damaged die or a mix-up at the minting facility. Others believe it was a deliberate act by a rogue mint employee. Regardless of the reason, one thing is certain, these no-mint mark pennies are extremely rare and highly sought after by collectors. So, just how valuable is a 1981 Lincoln penny without a mint mark? Well, let me tell you, it's worth a pretty penny, pun intended. Depending on the condition of the coin, these rare gems can fetch anywhere from a few hundred dollars to several thousand dollars. That's right, folks, a single penny could potentially make you a small fortune, the demand for these no-mint mark 1981 Lincoln pennies is off the charts. Collectors all over the world are eager to get their hands on one of these elusive coins. And with such a limited supply, prices are only going up. If you happen to stumble upon one of these rare treasures in your coin collection, consider yourself one lucky duck now. You might be wondering, how can I tell if I have a 1981 Lincoln penny without a mint mark? Well, it's quite simple, really. Just flip the coin over and take a close look at the bottom of the coin under the date. 
If you don't see a D or P mint mark, congratulations, you may have hit the jackpot, of course, with such high stakes involved, it's always a good idea to have your coin authenticated by a professional grading service. This will not only confirm the authenticity of your no mint mark penny but also ensure that you get top dollar for your rare find. Remember, it's better to be safe than sorry when it comes to valuable coins. In conclusion, the 1981 Lincoln penny without a mint mark is a true rarity in the world of coin collecting. With its high value and limited availability, this elusive coin has become a prized possession for collectors everywhere. So, keep your eyes peeled and your coin collection organized, you never know when you might come across one of these valuable gems. 1984, you may be wondering if that humble penny in your pocket or coin collection could actually be worth a small fortune. Well, stick around, because we're about to uncover the truth about the elusive 1984 Lincoln penny with no mint mark, brief history of the 1984 Lincoln penny a first minted over a century ago in 1909, the Lincoln penny has become an iconic symbol of American currency. Over the years, there have been various editions and designs of the penny, each with its own unique characteristics. The 1984 Lincoln penny is no exception, but what makes it particularly special is the absence of a mint mark, which typically indicates where the coin was produced. The mystery of the missing mint mark, one of the key factors that can significantly impact the value of a coin is the presence or absence of a mint mark. In the case of the 1984 Lincoln penny, the missing mint mark has sparked intrigue and speculation among collectors. Some believe that these coins were minted in error, while others argue that they may have been intentionally produced as a test run or prototype potential value of the 1984 Lincoln penny. So, you're probably wondering, could this seemingly ordinary 1984 Lincoln penny without a mint mark actually be worth a substantial amount of money? The answer is yes, it's entirely possible. While not every 1984 penny without a mint mark is valuable, there have been reported cases of these coins selling for hundreds or even thousands of dollars at auctions and online marketplaces, factors affecting the value of the coin. When determining the value of a 1984 Lincoln penny without a mint mark, there are several factors to consider. The condition of the coin is paramount, as a well-preserved coin will fetch a higher price than one with signs of wear and tear. Additionally, the rarity of the coin plays a significant role. The fewer 1984 pennies without mint marks in circulation, the more valuable they become. How to identify a 1984 Lincoln penny with no mint mark? So, how can you tell if you've stumbled upon one of these elusive gems in your collection? The absence of a mint mark can be quite subtle, so you'll need to examine the coin closely. Look for the date 1984 on the obverse side of the penny, and check the reverse side for any indication of a mint mark, such as a small D or S near the bottom edge. If you can't find a mint mark, Congratulations, you may have struck coin collecting gold. Where to find a 1984 Lincoln penny without a mint mark? If you're feeling inspired to start searching for your own 1984 Lincoln penny without a mint mark, there are a few places you can look. Coin shops, online auctions, and coin shows are all great options for expanding your collection and hunting down rare coins. You never know, that next lucky find could be waiting just around the corner. Conclusion In conclusion, the 1984 Lincoln penny without a mint mark is a fascinating and potentially valuable coin that has captured the attention of collectors worldwide. Whether you're a seasoned numismatist or just starting out in the hobby, keep an eye out for this elusive treasure in your collection. Who knows, you may just stumble upon a rare and valuable piece of coin collecting history. 1985 Lincoln penny with a D-mint mark you may be wondering if this seemingly ordinary coin could actually be worth a lot of big money. Well, stick around as we uncover the potential value of this overlooked gem from the past. Let's start by discussing the significance of the D-Mint mark on a 1985 Lincoln penny. The D-Mint mark indicates that the coin was minted at the Denver Mint, one of the oldest operating mints in the United States. Coins produced at different mints can vary in rarity and value, making a D-mint mark a crucial factor in determining the worth of a coin and now, you might be wondering why a seemingly common coin like a Lincoln penny could potentially be worth a significant amount. Well, it all comes down to a few key factors that collectors look for when assessing the value of a coin. One of the most important factors is the coin's mintage, or the number of coins produced in a given year at a specific mint. In the case of the 1985 Lincoln penny with a D-mint mark, the mintage numbers were significantly lower compared to other years, making it a more sought-after coin among collectors. Another crucial aspect to consider when determining the value of a coin is its condition. A well-preserved coin with minimal wear and tear will always command a higher price than one that has been heavily circulated. 
So, if you happen to come across a 1985 Lincoln Penny with a D-Mint mark in mint condition, you could be looking at a valuable addition to your collection, but, you might be wondering, just how much could a 1985 Lincoln Penny with a D-Mint mark be worth? Well, it ultimately depends on a variety of factors, including rarity, demand, and condition. While some coins may only fetch a few dollars, others have been known to sell for thousands of dollars at auction. It's all about finding the right buyer who is willing to pay top dollar for a rare and well-preserved coin. If you're interested in finding out the potential value of your 1985 Lincoln penny with a D-Mint mark, there are a few steps you can take to assess its worth. First, you'll want to carefully examine the coin for any signs of wear or damage. Next, you can consult a reputable coin dealer or appraiser to get a professional opinion on the coin's value. Additionally, you can research recent sales of similar coins to get a sense of what collectors are willing to pay when it comes to collecting coins, it's important to remember that the value of a coin can fluctuate over time. What may be considered a valuable coin today could become less sought after in the future, or vice versa. That's why it's important to stay informed and educated about the world of coin collecting to make informed decisions about buying and selling coins. In conclusion, the 1985 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark may not seem like much at first glance, but don't underestimate the potential value of this overlooked coin. With its lower mintage numbers and potential rarity, this coin could be a hidden gem in your collection that could fetch a significant sum if the right buyer comes along. So, next time you come across a 1985 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark, be sure to give it a second look and consider the possibilities of adding a valuable piece of history to your coin collection. Who knows, you may just stumble upon a rare and valuable coin that could be worth a lot of big money. 1987 Lincoln Penny with No Mint Mark This coin is one of those hidden gems that has the potential to be worth a lot of big money. So, if you were lucky enough to have one of these rare coins in your collection, you might just be in for a pleasant surprise, first things first, Let's talk about why the 1987 Lincoln penny with no mint mark is so special. In 1987, the United States Mint made a mistake and forgot to put the mint mark on some of the pennies that were produced that year. This error is what makes these coins so rare and valuable to collectors. The absence of a mint mark makes these coins stand out from the rest and adds to their allure. Now, you may be wondering just how much a 1987 Lincoln penny with no mint mark is worth. Well, the value of these coins can vary greatly depending on their condition and rarity. In general, a 1987 Lincoln penny with no mint mark in good condition can be worth anywhere from a few hundred dollars to several thousand dollars. However, if you happen to have one of these coins in mint condition, it could be worth even more. Some collectors have reported selling these coins for tens of thousands of dollars, making them a truly valuable find. So, how can you tell if you have a 1987 Lincoln penny with no mint mark? Well, the first thing you should do is carefully examine the coin. Look for any signs of a mint mark on the front or back of the coin. If you don't see a mint mark, you may have a rare 1987 Lincoln penny in your hands. You can also use a magnifying glass to get a closer look at the coin and check for any slight imperfections that could indicate its rarity. If you think you have a 1987 Lincoln penny with no mint mark, the next step is to have it authenticated by a professional. This will help ensure that your coin is the real deal and not just a regular penny that has been altered to look like the rare variety. Once your coin has been authenticated, you can then start to explore its potential value and decide whether you want to keep it in your collection or sell it to a collector who is willing to pay top dollar for such a rare find. In conclusion, the 1987 Lincoln penny with no mint mark is a rare and valuable coin that is highly sought after by collectors. If you happen to have one of these coins in your possession, you could be sitting on a gold mine. So, take the time to carefully examine your coin, have it authenticated, and explore its potential value. You never know, you may just have a small fortune in your hands. 1987 Lincoln Penny with the Elusive D Mint Mark Could this little copper coin be worth a big chunk of change? Let's find out together. First, let's talk a bit about the 1987 Lincoln Penny. This coin is part of the long-standing tradition of the Lincoln Sense series, which began in 1909 to honor the 16th President of the United States. The 1987 penny was minted in large numbers, reaching over 6 billion coins in total. However, what makes this particular penny special is the presence of the D mint mark, which indicates that it was minted at the Denver Mint. Now, you might be wondering why the D mint mark is so important when it comes to coin collecting. 
Well, the Denver Mint is one of the oldest operating mints in the United States and is known for producing fewer coins compared to its counterparts. This means that coins with the D mint mark are generally more scarce and can fetch a higher price among collectors. So, what exactly is a 1987 Lincoln penny with the D mint mark worth? Well, the value of a coin is determined by a variety of factors, including its condition, rarity, and demand among collectors. In the case of the 1987 D penny, a coin in average circulated condition can be worth anywhere from 25 cents to a few dollars. However, if you happen to come across a well-preserved specimen in mint state condition, you could be looking at a significant increase in value. It's also worth noting that the 1987 D Lincoln penny is known to have a few interesting errors and varieties that can add to its value. One such variety is the double die error, where certain parts of the design appear to be doubled due to a mistake in the minting process. Coins with these errors can be highly sought after by collectors and can command a premium price. Another important factor to consider when determining the value of a coin is its demand among collectors. The 1987 D. Lincoln penny is a popular choice for many numismatists due to its historical significance and unique mint mark. This high demand can drive up the price of the coin, especially for those in pristine condition or with rare errors. When it comes to grading a coin, there are several professional grading services that can help determine its condition and assign a grade based on a scale from poor to perfect. Coins that are graded higher on this scale generally command a higher price on the market, so it's worth considering getting your coin professionally graded if you believe it to be in exceptional condition. I in conclusion, the 1987 D. Lincoln Penny is a fascinating coin with the potential to be worth a significant amount of money for collectors. While the majority of these coins may not be worth more than face value, it's always worth keeping an eye out for rare varieties, errors, and coins in mint state condition. Who knows, you may just have a hidden gem in your coin collection waiting to be discovered. 1988 Lincoln Penny with a D mint mark. You might be wondering if this seemingly ordinary coin could actually be worth a lot of big money. Well, stick around because we're going to uncover the potential value and significance of this particular penny. First of all, let's talk a little bit about the 1988 Lincoln penny itself. This coin features the iconic image of Abraham Lincoln on the obverse, with the words, In God We Trust, and the year 1988 inscribed around the edge. On the reverse side, you'll find the familiar Lincoln memorial design, along with the words, United States of America, and one cent. So far, pretty standard stuff, right? But here's where things get interesting, the D mint mark. The D mint mark indicates that this penny was minted at the Denver Mint, one of the United States mint facilities responsible for producing circulating coins. Mint marks can significantly impact the value of a coin, as they indicate where and when the coin was produced. In the case of the 1988 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark, its rarity and condition are key factors in determining its potential worth now. Let's address the big question, is the 1988 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark worth a lot of big money? The short answer is, it depends. While most circulated 1988 Lincoln pennies with a D mint mark are not considered rare or valuable, there are some exceptions. If you happen to come across a well-preserved specimen in mint condition, it could fetch a pretty penny, pun intended, among collectors. Point one potential treasure to look out for is a 1988 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark that has been struck on a double die planchet. This type of error coin occurs when the die used to strike the coin is doubled, resulting in a distorted or doubled image. These varieties are highly sought after by collectors and can command significant premiums in the marketplace. Another factor that can increase the value of a 1988 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark is its grading. Coins are graded on a scale from poor to perfect, with higher grades indicating better condition. If you happen to have a coin that is in exceptional condition, it could be worth more than its face value to the right buyer. Of course, it's important to remember that the value of any coin ultimately comes down to supply and demand. While some 1988 Lincoln pennies with a D mint mark may be worth a lot of money to collectors, others may only fetch a modest premium. It all depends on the market at any given time. So, how can you determine the value of your 1988 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark? One option is to consult a professional coin dealer or numismatist who can provide an expert appraisal. Additionally, there are online resources, such as coin pricing guides and forums, where you can get an idea of the current market value for your coin. I in conclusion, while the 1988 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark may not be a guaranteed jackpot, it's worth taking a closer look at your coin collection to see if you have any hidden gems. Who knows, you might just have a rare and valuable treasure sitting right under your nose.
1991 Lincoln Penny with a D mint mark. You might be wondering, is this coin worth a lot of big money? Well, stick around because we're going to unravel the mystery behind this little piece of history. First things first, let's talk about the 1991 Lincoln Penny itself. This particular coin is part of the long standing tradition of the United States mint producing one cent coins featuring Abraham Lincoln, the 16th President of the United States. The D mint mark indicates that the coin was minted at the Denver Mint, one of the three mint facilities operated by the U.S. Mint. And now, you might be thinking, why is the mint mark important when it comes to determining the value of a coin? Well, the mint mark indicates where the coin was produced, and coins minted at certain facilities can be rarer than others. In the case of the 1991 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark, coins minted at the Denver Mint tend to have lower mintages compared to those minted at the Philadelphia Mint, making them potentially more valuable to collectors. So, let's get down to brass tacks. Is the 1991 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark worth a lot of big money? The short answer is, it depends. As with any coin, the value of the 1991 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark is determined by a variety of factors, including its condition, rarity, and demand in the collector's market. Point one important factor to consider is the condition of the coin. A 1991 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark in pristine, uncirculated condition will likely fetch a higher price than one that shows signs of wear and tear. Collectors tend to price coins with sharp details and lustrous surfaces, so keeping your coin in top-notch condition is key to maximizing its value. Rarity is another crucial factor in determining the value of the 1991 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark. While mintages for this particular coin are not exceptionally low, coins in high grades can still command significant premiums due to their scarcity in the marketplace. Keep an eye out for any anomalies or errors on the coin that may make it even rarer and more valuable to collectors. Demand also plays a role in the value of the 1991 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark. Collectors are always on the lookout for coins that add something unique to their collections, whether it's a rare date or mint mark, an error coin, or a coin with a fascinating history. If there is high demand for this particular coin among collectors, its value could skyrocket. So, how much could a 1991 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark potentially be worth? Well, prices can vary widely depending on the factors we've discussed. While some coins may only be worth a few cents over face value, others could fetch hundreds or even thousands of dollars at auction. It all comes down to finding the right buyer who is willing to pay top dollar for your coin. I in conclusion, the 1991 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark may not make you an instant millionaire, but it's still a fascinating piece of American numismatic history that could hold value to the right collector. Whether you're a seasoned coin enthusiast or a beginner looking to dip your toes into the world of coin collecting, this coin is definitely worth adding to your collection. So, next time you come across a 1991 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark in your pocket change, take a closer look and see if you've got a hidden gem on your hands. Who knows, you might just strike it rich with this little piece of copper and zinc. 1992 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark. Could this little coin hold the key to a big payday? Let's find out. First off, let's talk a little bit about the 1992 Lincoln penny itself. This copper-plated zinc coin features the iconic portrait of Abraham Lincoln on the obverse side, along with the words, In God We Trust, and the year 1992. But what sets this particular penny apart is the D mint mark, which indicates that it was minted at the Denver Mint in Colorado. The Denver Mint is one of the oldest mint facilities in the U.S., and coins produced here are highly sought after by collectors now. You may be wondering why is the 1992 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark so special? Well, it all comes down to rarity and demand. In the world of coin collecting, scarcity plays a huge role in determining the value of a coin. And when it comes to the 1992 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark, it is considered to be a low mintage coin. This means that fewer of these coins were produced compared to other pennies from the same year making them harder to find and therefore more valuable. But just how much is a 1992 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark worth? Well, that's where things get interesting. While the value of this coin can vary depending on its condition and other factors, some collectors have reported selling these pennies for as much as $50 or even more. That's quite a significant return on a coin that only has a face value of one cent. So, how can you tell if you have a valuable 1992 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark in your collection? The first thing you'll want to do is check the mint mark on the coin. Look for the small letter D located below the date on the obverse side. If you see this mint mark, 
congratulations, you may have struck gold, or rather, copper, next, take a close look at the condition of the coin. Is it shiny and free of scratches, or does it show signs of wear and tear? Coins that are in mint or near mint condition are generally more valuable than those that show a lot of wear. Of course, some collectors also price coins with a bit of patina or toning, so don't discount a coin just because it's not in perfect condition. Once you've assessed the mint mark and condition of your 1992 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark, you may want to consider having it professionally graded. Grading services can provide a certification of the coin's authenticity and condition which can help increase its value when it comes time to sell a now. You may be wondering, where can you sell a valuable 1992 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark? There are several options available to you, depending on your preferences. Online marketplaces like eBay and Etsy are popular choices for selling coins, as are coin collecting forums and websites. You could also consider reaching out to a local coin dealer or attending a coin show to see if there are any interested buyers. Die in conclusion. The 1992 Lincoln Penny with a D-Mint mark is a fascinating coin that has captured the attention of collectors around the world. With its low mintage and potential for high value, this little penny could be your ticket to a big payday. So, if you happen to come across one of these coins in your collection, be sure to take a closer look, you may just have a hidden treasure on your hands. 1995 Lincoln Penny with a D-Mint mark have you ever come across one of these bad boys in your pocket change and wondered if it's worth more than its face value? Well, you're in luck because we're about to uncover the potential hidden treasure that could be hiding in plain sight. Let's start by going back in time to 1995 when the United States Mint released the Lincoln penny with the iconic portrait of Abraham Lincoln on the obverse side. This coin was minted at various locations across the country, including the Denver Mint, which is denoted by the D-Mint mark that appears below the date on the coin. The Lincoln penny has been a staple in American currency since 1909, making it a favorite among collectors and enthusiasts alike. Now, you might be wondering what makes the 1995 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark so special. Well, the mint mark indicates where the coin was minted, and in the case of the Denver Mint, coins produced there are typically seen as more desirable to collectors due to their lower mintages compared to coins minted at other locations. This scarcity factor can drive up the value of the coin, especially if it's in pristine condition. When it comes to determining the value of a 1995 Lincoln penny with a D-mint mark, there are a few key factors to consider. The first is the coin's condition. Coins that are in uncirculated or near-mint condition will typically command a higher price than those that show signs of wear and tear. Next, the rarity of the coin plays a significant role in determining its value. If the 1995 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark has a low mintage or is considered a key date, its value could potentially skyrocket. So, how much could a 1995 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark potentially be worth? Well, it all depends on the factors we discussed earlier. In general, these coins can range in value from a few dollars to potentially hundreds or even thousands of dollars for coins in exceptional condition or with unique characteristics. With the growing interest in coin collecting and investing, there's a chance that the value of these coins could continue to increase over time, making them a potentially lucrative investment opportunity. And if you think you might have a 1995 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark in your possession, there are a few ways to verify its authenticity. The first step is to check the date on the coin and look for the D mint mark below it. Next, examine the overall condition of the coin and look for any signs of wear or damage that could affect its value. Finally, Consider having the coin professionally graded by a reputable grading service to get an accurate assessment of its condition and potential value. In conclusion, the 1995 Lincoln penny with a D mint mark is a fascinating coin with the potential to be worth a significant amount of money for collectors and enthusiasts. With its historical significance, scarcity factor, and market demand, this coin has all the makings of a hidden gem waiting to be discovered. So, keep an eye out for these elusive coins in your pocket change, and who knows, you might just stumble upon a valuable piece of American numismatic history. 2013 Lincoln Penny with No Mint Mark Could this little coin be worth a big chunk of money? Let's dive in and find out. Before we get into the nitty-gritty details, let's talk a bit about the 2013 Lincoln Penny. This particular penny was minted to honor the 100th anniversary of the Lincoln cent. What makes this coin special is that some of them were minted without a mint mark, unlike other pennies that usually have a P4 Philadelphia or a D4 Denver. These no mint mark coins are quite rare and highly sought after by collectors. The 2013 Lincoln penny with no mint mark looks just like a regular penny at first glance. 
It features a profile of Abraham Lincoln on the obverse side, and the Lincoln Memorial on the reverse side. The absence of a mint mark is what sets this coin apart from others. It's crucial to inspect the coin closely to see if it indeed lacks a mint mark, as some may have worn off over time. Point one of the key factors that determine the value of a coin is its scarcity. The 2013 Lincoln penny with no mint mark falls into the category of low mintage coins, making it relatively scarce compared to other pennies from the same year. Collectors are always on the lookout for rare coins like this one, as they add a unique and valuable piece to their collection. As a result of its scarcity, the 2013 Lincoln penny with no mint mark is in high demand among coin collectors. Many enthusiasts are willing to pay a premium price to add this coin to their collection. The thrill of hunting for rare coins like this one adds an exciting element to the hobby of coin collecting now. Let's get down to the big question, is the 2013 Lincoln penny with no mint mark worth a lot of money? The short answer is yes, it can be. Depending on the condition of the coin, its rarity, and the current market demand, this penny could potentially fetch a substantial amount of money. Some collectors have reported selling their 2013 Lincoln pennies with no mint mark for hundreds or even thousands of dollars. When determining the value of a coin, its condition plays a significant role. A well preserved 2013 Lincoln penny with no mint mark and mint state condition can command a higher price than one that shows signs of wear and tear. It's essential to store and handle your coins carefully to maintain their value over time. Coin grading is another crucial aspect that collectors consider when evaluating the worth of a coin. Professional grading services can provide an unbiased assessment of the condition of your coin and assign it a grade on the Sheldon scale. The higher the grade, the more valuable the coin is likely to be. Investing in professional grading services can potentially increase the resale value of your 2013 Lincoln penny with no mint mark. Like any commodity, the value of coins fluctuates based on market trends and collector preferences. Keeping an eye on the latest developments in the coin market can help you make informed decisions about buying, selling, or holding on to your 2013 Lincoln penny with no mint mark. Online coin forums, auction sites, and coin shows are excellent resources for staying updated on market trends. Die and conclusion, the 2013 Lincoln penny with no mint mark is a fascinating and potentially valuable coin that holds a special place in the hearts of collectors. Its rarity, demand, and historical significance make it a prized addition to any coin collection. If you happen to come across one of these elusive pennies, consider yourself lucky and take good care of it. Who knows, it could be worth a lot of big money in the future. Thanks for tuning in, and happy hunting for rare coins. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more coin collecting content. Feel free to leave a comment below if you have any questions or stories to share about the 2013 Lincoln Penny with no mint mark. 1984 Lincoln Penny with no mint mark You might be wondering, is this coin worth a lot of big money? Well, stick around as we uncover the mysteries behind this elusive penny now. Before we get into the nitty-gritty details, let's understand the significance of mint marks on coins. A mint mark is a small letter or symbol that denotes where a coin was minted. For example, the P mint mark represents the Philadelphia Mint, D4 Denver, and S4 San Francisco. However, the 1984 Lincoln penny stands out because it was the only year where no mint mark was placed on these cents, making it a unique and sought after piece for collectors. So, how do you identify if you have a 1984 Lincoln penny with no mint mark? Well, grab a magnifying glass and take a closer look at the coin. If you spot a clear absence of the mint mark above the date on the penny, Congratulations, you might just be holding a valuable piece of history in your hands. Keep in mind that fakes and altered coins exist, so it's always best to consult with a professional or use authentication tools to verify the authenticity of your coin. And now, let's address the burning question, is the 1984 Lincoln penny with no mint mark worth a lot of big money? The short answer is yes, but the actual value can vary depending on its condition and rarity. While a regular 1984 Lincoln penny may only be worth face value, the no mint mark variant can fetch anywhere from a few hundred dollars to several thousand dollars for pristine, uncirculated specimens. Factors such as toning, luster, and overall eye appeal can significantly impact the value of these coins in the collector's market. In recent years, auctions and online marketplaces have witnessed a surge in demand for the 1984 Lincoln penny with no mint mark. Collectors are willing to pay top dollar for these elusive coins especially if they are in exceptional condition. Keep in mind that the rarity of these coins plays a crucial role in determining their market value, 
so it's essential to do your research and consult with experts before selling or buying one of these gems when it comes to determining the value of your 1984 Lincoln penny with no mint mark, coin grading plays a vital role. The condition of a coin is assessed on a scale ranging from poor, P1, to perfect, MS70. For these pennies, higher grades such as mint state, MS65 or above command the most significant premiums in the market. Factors like scratches, wear, and discoloration can lower the grade and, subsequently, the value of the coin. It's essential to keep an eye out for counterfeits and altered coins when collecting 1984 Lincoln pennies with no mint mark. Due to their rarity and value, unscrupulous individuals may attempt to pass off counterfeit or altered coins as genuine. To protect yourself, always purchase coins from reputable dealers or have your coins authenticated by certified professionals. Remember, it's better to be safe than sorry when it comes to investing in rare and valuable numismatic treasures. Die in conclusion, the 1984 Lincoln penny with no mint mark is a hidden gem that holds significant value for collectors and enthusiasts alike. Whether you're a seasoned numismatist or a beginner in the coin collecting world, adding one of these elusive pennies to your collection can be a rewarding and profitable experience. Remember to do your research, seek expert advice, and enjoy the thrill of uncovering hidden treasures in the vast and exciting world of coin collecting. Closing shot of a 1984 Lincoln penny with no mint mark. Thank you for joining us on this numismatic journey. If you found this video informative and entertaining, be sure to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more coin-related content. Until next time, happy hunting and may your coin collection shine bright with rare and valuable treasures. Take care and happy coin collecting. 1995 Lincoln Penny with No Mint Mark You might be wondering, is this coin worth a lot of big money? Well, stick around as we dive deep into the world of coin collecting and uncover the secrets of this unique piece, first things first, let's talk about the history of this coin. The Lincoln Penny has been a staple in American coinage since 1909, honoring the beloved 16th President of the United States, Abraham Lincoln. In 1995, the U.S. Mint produced millions of these pennies, but what makes the no-mint mark version so special? Well, here's where it gets interesting. The absence of a mint mark on a coin can sometimes indicate a mint error or a rare variety. In the case of the 1995 Lincoln penny, the no-mint mark version was actually produced at the Philadelphia Mint, which typically adds a P-mint mark to its coins. However, due to a mistake in the minting process, some of these pennies were released without the mint mark. So, you might be wondering, how rare is the 1995 Lincoln penny with no mint mark? According to experts in the numismatic community, it is estimated that only a small percentage of the 1995 pennies minted at the Philadelphia Mint were struck without the mint mark. This makes the no mint mark version quite scarce compared to its counterparts. Now, let's address the big question, is the 1995 Lincoln penny with no mint mark worth a lot of big money? Well, the value of a coin is determined by several factors, including its rarity, condition, and demand among collectors. In the case of this particular penny, its rarity certainly plays a significant role in its value. I in recent years, the 1995 Lincoln penny without a mint mark has been known to fetch impressive prices at coin auctions and sales. Some high-grade examples have sold for hundreds, if not thousands of dollars, making them a sought-after treasure for numismatists worldwide. If you happen to come across a 1995 Lincoln penny with no mint mark in your coin collection, it's essential to have it professionally graded to determine its condition and potential value. A coin grading service can provide you with a detailed assessment of your penny, giving you a better idea of its worth in today's market. Additionally, if you're looking to sell or trade your 1995 Lincoln penny without a mint mark, be sure to consult with reputable coin dealers or auction houses. They can help you navigate the complexities of the numismatic market and ensure that you receive a fair price for your priced coin. In conclusion, the 1995 Lincoln penny with no mint mark is indeed a coin worth a lot of big money for those lucky enough to possess one. Its rarity and unique status in the world of coin collecting make it a valuable addition to any collection. So, if you happen to stumble upon one of these rare gems, Consider yourself fortunate and treasure it with pride. 2005 Edition with No Mint Mark You might be wondering if this seemingly ordinary coin could actually be worth a pretty penny, pun intended. Well, stick around as we uncover the truth behind the value of this somewhat mysterious coin. First off, let's talk a bit about the 2005 Lincoln penny itself. As you may already know, the United States Mint produces millions of coins each year, each one bearing a mint mark that indicates where it was produced. However, in the case of the 2005 Lincoln penny, 
some coins were mistakenly minted without a mint mark at all. This error is relatively rare, making these coins highly sought after by collectors at now. You may be wondering just how much a 2005 Lincoln penny without a mint mark could potentially be worth. Well, the value of any coin is influenced by a variety of factors, including its rarity, condition, and demand among collectors. In the case of the 2005 Lincoln penny without a mint mark, its rarity alone makes it a valuable find. Some experts estimate that these coins could be worth anywhere from $100 to $500, or even more, depending on their condition. Of course, the condition of the coin plays a significant role in determining its value. A well preserved 2005 Lincoln penny without a mint mark in mint condition could fetch a higher price than one that shows signs of wear and tear. Collectors are always on the lookout for coins that are in pristine condition, so if you happen to come across one of these rare coins in excellent shape, you could be looking at a nice payout. Now, you might be wondering how to tell if you have a 2005 Lincoln penny without a mint mark in your possession. The most straightforward way to identify this coin is to take a close look at the bottom of the coin, where the date is displayed. If you see the year 2005 with no mint mark located below it, congratulations, you may have stumbled upon a valuable treasure. Be sure to examine the coin carefully under good lighting to check for any signs of wear or damage that could affect its overall value. If you're still uncertain about the authenticity of your 2005 Lincoln penny without a mint mark, you may want to consider getting it professionally authenticated. Coin experts and grading services can provide you with a certification that verifies the coin's legitimacy and condition, giving you peace of mind and potentially increasing its value even further when it comes to selling a rare coin like the 2005 Lincoln penny without a mint mark there are several options available to you. You could try selling it through online auction sites, coin dealers, or even coin shows. Keep in mind that the value of the coin may fluctuate based on current market trends and demand, so it's essential to do your research and stay informed about the coin collecting community. Die in conclusion, the 2005 Lincoln penny without a mint mark is indeed a valuable and sought-after coin among collectors. Its rarity and potential worth make it a thrilling find for anyone interested in numismatics. So, if you happen to come across one of these elusive coins in your possession, consider yourself lucky, you may be holding a fortune in the palm of your hand.